So today we're going to be talking about the irregular adjectives beau, nouveau, ah, and vieux. So beau, nouveau, nouveau, and vieux. Let's make it so that the whole thing shows. What does beau mean? Beautiful or good looking. Nouveau? New. Vieux. Old. Old. Okay. Beauty, age, and age. Bags. They go in front of the noun, they modify. So, if you, they, and they have to agree with what they, let's start with beau, what they described. Le beau garçon, for example. La belle fille. It's a, the female, the feminine version is Belle. And now we need something that starts with a vowel for singular masculine. So if we have, let's use ordinateur, whoops. <coughs> masculine, singular. This is gonna be not very good video, is it? I think I messed up. Oh well, who cares? Okay. Le bel ordinateur. Because it starts with a vowel. The masculine form of bow look sounds like this sounds like this bell. Then the two plurals, le beau garçon. And les belles filles. Words that end in e u x, I mean e a u in French, have an x in the plural form. They're still considered irregular, but you add an x to it for the plural. As in les beaux chapeaux. Nouveau is similar. It has the same endings. Un nouveau livre. Une nouvelle voiture. Des Nouveau chapeau. Plural masculine. De nouvelle <coughs> bicyclette. Masculine with a vowel would be as in un nouvel étudiant. Ça va so far? Oui. So nouvel, uh, beau and nouveau have the same endings, the same changes in patterns. Vieux is a little bit different. It always has an X on it, whether it's describing one or more masculine things, as in, we don't want, really want to, well, we can. Okay, un vieux, tell me an old thing that's masculine. Skyan. Un vieux livre. That's what we have in this classroom, right? Des vieux livres. Or de vieux livre. We have beaucoup de, de, de vieux livre dans cette classe. The feminine form is vie, une vie, 
The name of Kelka shows feminine. Avez-vous peur parce que vous êtes à la télé? Une chose feminine. Ah, une vieille ceinture. Day. Yay. Chaussure. Merci. Vowel. Un. Vieil. Pas ordinateur, pas ampère. Quoi d'autre? Un vieil. Je ne peux pas penser. Hmm? Oh, j'ai fait une Un vieil avec. Oh, yeah. Insect. Ah. Ampère. <laughs> Imperméable. So, remember the sandwich thing I showed you on, on Friday? So, this is how I remember the order of these vowels, the I, E, I in the middle of the feminine and the vowel form. And that is, it looks like a sandwich. It looks like this in the middle of those words. And if you turn it like this, there's some bread, there's the stuff in the middle like some sort of meat or something, and there's the other part of the bread. I made that up. I did. It's good, isn't it? So bags I didn't make up. Most of the other stuff I teach in here I learned from another French teacher. But that came to me and I thought, that helps me. I'll tell my students about it. Vieux, of course, does not have eyes in it. it. But it does have this typical French thing. I-E-U-X is typical in, Fran in a lot of French words. But this, this is weird for us. We who speak English, this thing in the middle is odd. It looks strange. We want to leave one of those vowels out. We just do. So anyway, I hope that maybe giving it your attention for a few minutes will help you remember to put them all in there. So that's that. We'll see how exciting this video is.